Oh, no. We're oh, trying no. to end Wardlow's oh, career. God, Dude, it's no. no. God. Ten, that is what? It. what up, y'all? This your boy Ace here. And welcome to After News Tonight. Wow. First off, Warlow Powerhouse House, pop 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 Powerhouse. First off, amazing match. First of all, I like how it started in the parking lot. I, I love that. I love that. That is so. It basically started out as like a street fight almost, but uh, it was a fall count anywhere match. So a lot of things are legal in this match. And uh, it was fire. The crowd was loving it. They were loud. They, they gave a "This is awesome" chant. Uh, chant broke out. Really good match. It was definitely better than the TNT Championship match between Wardlow and Saint Samoa Joe. This is a pay per view quality match, man. It should have actually been on the pay per view, but the ending was everything, bro. The ending was everything. Wardlow looked like he was about to put. Hobbs out the pasture, and I was worried because I'm a Hobbs fan. So I wanted Hobbs to get this belt so badly tonight. So, anyways, we had a surprise appearance. None other than QT Marshall. QT Marshall was a man of his word, bro. He said he was going to help out Hobbs, and he did just that. Marshall kicked Wardlow on the balls, and then Wardlow, uh, then he hit Wardlow with a couple of more uh, chair shots. Hobbs got to his feet as Marshall was picking him up. And that's when uh, Hobbs and Marshall teamed up to toss Wardlow uh, onto a padded uh, platform off the stage. The referee counted to 10. And guess who your new TNT Championship is? Champion is his powerhouse Hobbs, bro. My man finally got... A fucking belt, bro. I've been waiting three years for this dude to get a belt, bro. He finally got it. Yes. My man's finally got this belt, bro. I've been, bro, for those of y'all that been on my channel, y'all remember back in November, I wanted this dude to get it at full gear. He finally got it. And what I liked about it is that they did make Wardlow look weak. It didn't look like he only had the title for three days. Because he's nothing. No. They had QT Marshall help uh, Hobbs. So it makes it look like Warlow didn't really lose. In a, in a sense. Because he was obviously cheated here. Uh, so I like that. I like that. Because it, 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 it gave them an excuse to put the title on Hobbs. Without making Warlow look like a three day champion. And it's crazy. Because the, the, the commentary team. They were like. Will he be the only three day champion? I remember that at Revolution. That stuck out to me. That. Tony Khan might book this this way. So, loving it, man. I love it. And I love it that he's teaming with QT Marshall now. That is awesome. It reminds me of uh, MJF with Stokely Hathaway. Whether he stays with QT Marshall or not, I like it. And I like how QT Marshall was a man of his word. That actually, that's like a new little wrinkle for QT Marshall. I like the little QTV shirt, too, that QT Marshall had on there. It, it was great. Great match. Really good win for Hobbs here, even though, you know, did come at, you know, uh, 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 he didn't get a clean finish. But I do like the way this went. I think Hobbs is a better champion. He's, bro, the crowd has been behind. I think he's got more steam behind him than Wardlow right now. Way more steam. So, let's see what happens, man. I think, I think Hobbs is going to be a pretty good TNT champion, too. So let's see the way he booked, though, man. I, I think I like this, man. Give me your thoughts, man. I'm going to come back to wrap this up. Okay, you guys, make sure y'all go going ahead and hit the like button, comment, and share the video. Also, make sure you guys also donate to the channel by hitting the thanks button below, or you can hit up the Cash App, dollar sign, sack exchange, to send any donation to the Cash App. Here are the top donators, and you can fit yourself in this list at any time if you donate at least $2 or more. Thank you. So, yeah, man, I didn't get a chance to do a, a poll on the uh, community tab for y'all, man. I, I apologize for that. I forgot to do it. I yeah. wanted to see who y'all was going to pick to win this match. But uh, something telling me y'all would have got it wrong anyways. Y'all wasn't going to pick Hobbs to win. Uh, not the overall majority. Y'all would have picked Warlow. Um, but... <laughs> 
But uh, I, I like it, man. So next video, we're going to talk about the QT Marshall uh, interference and death. So I hope I see y'all in that video. Thank y'all for watching this one. P -p 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 Powerhouse. Yes, he's champion. Thank you, Tony Khan, for putting this belt on this man. Because this dude, he's like the Bobby Lashley AEW, bro. He can be one of the top black dudes in AEW for a long time, bro. They need to continue to push him that way, bro. Thank y'all for watching. After news to like.